history. Full of dead old people, dates, wars... Boring, right? Wrong! Cos we've got the real juicy nuggets. The stuff they won't tell you in school. Fuck off. What? The Mad Men, the Loonies, the complete and other nincompoops. I can hear you. I can hear you when you say that. Oh, sorry. All right. The gory stories, the stupid deaths, the savage oh. feuds. Right, like well, that. you stink. Oh, -oh. Hang on to your head, especially if you're royal, for Horrible Histories. Tonight, 6.30 on ABC3. Many, many years ago, a terrible plague was turning the people of Firedor into horrible beasts. And a few nice, cuddly ones. <laughs> Their only hope of a cure rested with Princess Dick and Dom. Their light-fingered servant, Lutin, and their trusty mage, Manitor. Unfortunately, they were utterly useless. They dropped the first antidote, mucked up the replacement antidote... <laughs> Get out! ...and now must collect the ingredients to re-remake the antidote before all of Fyodor is doomed forever. The legend of Dick and Dom continues. <laughs> It was harvest time, and Princes Dick and Dom were hard at work collecting the next ingredient for the potion. No, will you keep quiet? You're going to scare off the turnips. Keep quiet? They're pecking on me pockets. Good. Well, at least it'll keep the birds busy. Now, look, we need a turnip for the potion. There's got to be one in this field somewhere. Look out now. The nipples, the nipples. Will you pull yourself together? I'll never find a turnip if you keep distracting me. <laughs> Oh, have you found one? Yes, yes, yes! Can we go now? Hmm? Hmm? Feast your eyes on... this. Ah! <laughs> hmm? Is that it? According to the scroll, we need the biggest turnip in Bottom World. Yeah, so that's the best we could find. It's pathetic. Well, then you've done better, have you? Uh, we, too, have scoured the fields of Enjorium and yea, delved deep into the vegetable mines of Herbaceous Border. And sold out. So, ours is the best we've got. Yeah. <laughs> oh, magic! Right! Back to the fields! Come on, Scarecrow. No, don't let me go back there. Ah, or we could just follow this sign over here. What sign? A much silage, home of the world's biggest turnip. <laughs> I believe that much silage is home to the most fertile soil in all of Bottom World. Yeah, it's uh, certainly got a distinctive smell. Yeah, for such a far old village, there doesn't seem to be much food around, does there? Greedy peasants. They must have eaten the lot. <laughs> <laughs> Will you stop playing with them, Dick? You've got a job to do. Let's ask this uh, greengrocer why to find a giant turnip. Oh, hello there. Spot to see you. Ooh. Now then. What? Can I offer you? Well, it doesn't look like you've got much to sell. Oh, well, let's pick your own, innit? Pick your own what? Well, whatever takes your fancy, really. But there's nothing there. Yeah, we are a bit low on stock, but uh, if this stall was full of veg, there wouldn't be mushroom for anything else, would there? Look, um, we're after the world's biggest turnip. Oh. Yeah, I think we found him. Oh, well, you've come to the right place. For I am Johnny Greenfingers. Grower, owner, and guardian of Bottom World's biggest turnip, wow. Betsy. Ole! Betsy. Ole! That's right. So, uh, why do they call you Green Fingers? Green Fingers. <clears throat> hey, oh, I've got no idea. Oh. Right then, follow me. You're just in time. We're going to eat her tomorrow. You're going to eat Betsy? No, Ole! <laughs> Oh, sorry, yeah, just joining in. Got no choice. She's the only food we got left in the village. 
But I thought much silage was a very fertile land. Oh, yeah, it is. Trouble is, we've got a slight problem with an ogre. An ogre? Fearsome creature. <clears throat> Eats everything we grow. We're starving. Right, then. Here she is. Boy, Betsy. I expect you're wondering how I got her so big. No, not really. Well, it's all to do with the acidity of the soil, the quality of the mulch, and my own special turnip massage. Oh, all right, that's enough. Yeah, she's perfect. We'll take her. How much do you want for her? Oh, no. I couldn't sell her. If I sold her, the village would starve, wouldn't it? Well, since you put it like that... I don't care! We need that turnip. Now stand aside. Oh, I'd like to see you, Troy. How do you think I kept the ogre off her all this time? She's got a protective spell on her. Watch. Beep, beep. Rubbish. <clears throat> Dick, give me a hand. Hmm? With the turnip! Well, I did warn you. <laughs> yep, very effective. So, uh, why don't you use this magic spell on all your crops? Well, it's expensive, isn't it? We could only afford to protect one vegetable. And it had to be a... Uh... No ogre's going to make off with you, are they, my dear? Has this ogre been troubling you for long? Uh, well, let me see. Today's last Tuesday in June. Uh... <laughs> last Tuesday in June? Already? What if I was to say we could rid you of this ogre forever? I'd say you were talking about somebody else. For we four are fearless ogre slayers. Oh. The last Tuesday. Oh, June. We've been on the road so long, I've lost track of time. It's... <laughs> if we rid your village of the ogre, will you give us Betsy <laughs> as payment? All right, it's a deal. <laughs> the last Tuesday in June? <laughs> it's... Garlic Tuesday! Fearless ogre slayers, you say? They were just psyching themselves up. Um, come on, we have work to do. Too right we have! Back to camp! It's Garlic Tuesday! <laughs> Oh, I am so excited. I think I'm going to wet myself. Uh, maybe later. <laughs> right, so, what about this wonderful plan, then? Of course we've got a plan. Dick's going to make the decorations and I'm going to make the hats. But how's that going to help us catch an ogre? Catch an ogre? Why would you want to do that? Sounds scary. Besides, it's Garlic Tuesday, and nobody works on Garlic, garlic Tuesday. <laughs> um, I have never heard of Garlic Tuesday. Don't be dumb. Uh, <laughs> no, everyone celebrates uh, Garlic Tuesday, yeah. don't they, Dom? Oh, yes, everybody celebrates Garlic Tuesday. <laughs> it's the fun filled festival of everything smelly. <laughs> <laughs> uh, OK, Dick, why don't you just go and uh, decorate a tree? Yeah. Brilliant, great. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Right. Look, OK, there's a reason why you've never heard of Garlic Tuesday. It's because he's the only person that celebrates it. And why is that? OK, it's like this. When Dick was seven, I had just a bit of harmless fun. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want it! Don't be a big baby. Everybody likes chocolate spread and garlic. You don't that big and strong like me. I don't care. <laughs> you have to eat it. Why? Because it's Garlic Tuesday. It's the fun field festival of everything stinky. You have to eat disgusting things. It's the law. Well, <laughs> if it is Garlic Tuesday. <laughs> <laughs> Delicious. <laughs> really? What else you got? <laughs> it's uh, chicken with fish paste, uh, mustard, and curry powder, and garlic. <laughs> 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 
Mm. Lovely. <coughs> Garlic and horseradish banana split. <laughs> mm. Mm. Yum. <laughs> Strawberry surprise. Huh? What's the surprise? Stuffed with garlic. <coughs> <coughs> What's for pudding? That's it. We're out of everything. Not fair. Don't worry. Garlic Tuesday comes round once a year. We can do it all again then. <gasps> I can't wait. You promise? Don't breathe on me. Uh, <laughs> you little swine. What do these what older brothers do? I wish I had now. Every year since then we have to celebrate Garlic Tuesday. It's become a tradition. Dick loves it. And what about you? I hate it. Stinks. I only do it for the look on his face. Look, don't tell him. It'll break his heart. Yes, and make you look like a horrible little... Yeah, exactly. Dom Dom, I've finished the garlic tree. <laughs> garlic? I've added a few things as the years have gone on. <laughs> Does anyone want to pull me garlic cracker? Oh, no. See? I, I hate right. garlic. Oh, don't be such a spoiled sport. Come on. <laughs> 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 Ooh, look, if you don't join in, you won't get a present from Farty Whiffmas. Uh. Farty Whiffmas? I know. He's a spirit of Garlic Tuesday. A grubby old man in a brown cloak. Creeps around while children are asleep and leaves them a stinking present. <laughs> Oh, yes, you have to leave for him a uh, glass of cod liver oil, a sprout pie, and, of course, a pickled onion for Rudy. And Rudy is...? Rudy, the red bum skunk pig, you know. Rudy, the red bum skunk pig, has a very shiny bum. Party with must fly through the air in a trough pulled by 12 flying skunk pigs propelled by their own magical trumps. This really is the stupidest thing you have ever come up with. Mm. And that includes egg tennis. Now, look, we have an important quest to fulfil. Can't be wasting our time with Garlic Tuesday. I agree with Manitou. Can't believe I just said that. No, 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 no. I I'm not going anywhere, cos Farty Whiffmas won't know where I've gone. Oh, yes, and I've got a garlic supper to prepare. Huh? We've got an ogre to catch. Ha I'm sure you can handle it. Right, fine. Luton, death and danger awaits. Danger, you say? Yes, hop to it. Thing is, um, my family, they celebrate Garlic Tuesday too. <laughs> what? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, um, it's really important to me, so I'm going to stay here and help out the boys and yeah. you can go off and uh, find that terrifying ogre, OK? Right, fine. Yes, good. I'll do it without you. Without you cramping my style, I'll have this ogre caught and brought to justice before nightfall. <laughs> so then, what do you want to do? Well, uh, yeah. assume that you can be Stinky Poggy. Come again, eh? Yeah, Stinky Poggy. He's a party with my little helper. He sits in the back of the trough, handing out Stinky presents. All right, then. Good. Uh, there's your potty. And here's a fish paste for your hair. Hey, whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa. No, 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 no. Do you know what? Stuff this. I think I'd rather take my chances with an ogre. Having decided that Garlic Tuesday wasn't really for her, Lutin set off to join Manitol, who was going to need all the help he could get. When I said I'd help, this wasn't exactly what I had in mind. Well, if you want to catch an ogre, we got to lure him out, haven't we? And you're the bait.
I think he likes you. <laughs> What's next in the plan? Well, how should I know? I got him here. You said you'd catch him. Yes, but I didn't think I'd be tied to this uh, to the state. <laughs> oh, don't say state. <laughs> Sorry. Ooh. Now you've got his attention. What's next? Uh, running really fast into the desert! Oh, good one. Well, that was fun. I can see your professionals. Untie me! Luton needs our help! Like the smell of garlic yeah. <coughs> on an open fire. Oh, look, <coughs> Luton. <laughs> oh, look, an ogre. Dom, Dom. <laughs> it's time oh. to hang up my stinky stocking, eh? <laughs> and it should be really good and stinky because huh? I haven't washed it since last year. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Oh. Yeah, farty whiffers won't have any problems oh. finding that. Oh. Have you got your whiffers list? Oh, yeah, of course. Yeah. Uh. Oh, it's a big one. Well, I've been a really smelly boy this year. Yes, mm -hmm. yes, you have. Right, right. Um, right. Uh, that's a lot of cag. I don't know if farty whiffers will have enough room in his trough for all that cag. Well, whatever he brings, I'll be happy, cos I love Garlic Tuesday. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> well, uh, might as well send the letter. Mm. Right, you know where to put it. Oh. Oh, stinky, stinky Poggy, Stinky Poggy, smells like you. Don. Yes? You know, after I've shoved this letter down your trousers... Yes? How does it get to Farty Whiffmas? By using very... very special magic. Oh, OK. Uh, <laughs> looks like she came through here very quickly. Stinky Poggy. Oh! Oh! oh. Oh, Mr. Greenfingers, come and join us for a garlic supper. You know, and the more the merrier. Oh, I like a bit of garlic. It's finger licking good. Oh, oh I love garlic. Oh. Mm. Wait, mm. just slow down. Oh. Oh. Look, you'll spoil your garlic supper. And also, if you're not careful, you won't get a visit from Farty Whiffmas. Oh. He's not likely to get a visit from Farty Whiffmas, is he? No. It's me. I'm Farty Whiffmas. I keep the costume in my bag. You don't do things by halves, do you? Mm -mm. Mm. You really are a complete loony. Mm. Farty Whiffmas is going to bring me loads of presents because I posted a letter down Dom's trousers. Oh, do you think you might have a present for me? Only if you've been a really smelly boy. Oh, I've been really smelly. That's the manure. Oh, fingers crossed then. <laughs> uh, uh, uh. Aren't we forgetting something? Oh, yeah. I got a postal letter down the back of your trousers. What? No, 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 no. The ogre? Oh, yes! Right, first things first, then let us be off. Oh. Ooh. You make me want to cough. Oh, stinky pong, oh. stinky pong. Right, right. Yes, the trail it ends by that cave over there. Oh, brilliant. She must have trapped the ogre in the cave. Oh, good. Oh, in you go then. Oh, <laughs> now, I'm sure Lutin has it all under control. <laughs> ah, Lutin! <laughs> yes, you, you've got it all under control. Thanks, thanks. Claws, eyes, hair. Yes, very good. Now, I want you to go back in there and drag him out for us. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Stand your ground. Oh. I'm sure he's more afraid of us than we are of him. <laughs> Too excited, and I want to wait on for Farty Whiffness. Well, he's not going to come if you're still awake. Oh, now, don't just go to sleep. Look, no, 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 I can't. Why? I'm listening for the sound of jingle smells. Oh, uh, just shut up. Go to sleep. Go to sleep. Go to sleep. Go to sleep. <laughs> oh, look, there's Luton. <laughs> <laughs> Manitol <Ooh>. and Johnny. <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, 
An angry ogre. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't it nice when everyone pops round for Garlic Tuesday? Oh, yeah. <laughs> now, come on, go to sleep. No, 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 I'm too excited! What? OK, I know what to help. Would you like some garlic sausage? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Works every time. <laughs> this all part of the plan, then? Shut, Shut up, Johnny! Johnny. Never fear, I know just the thing. What could be more useful to stop an ogre than a cauldron of boiling oil? Oh. Yeah. Ice pop, butter, candlestick, matchstick. Great. What are we supposed to do with that? Go to sleep, go to sleep, go to sleep, ugly ogre. La 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 la. La, 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 Shoelace, shuttlecock, broom! Ugh. It'll do. Come on, let's get him inside. Oh, back to the camp. We must show the princes that we've got him. They'll be so pleased with us all. Do you always give her up the ogres when you catch them? Oh, shut up, Johnny. Oh. Oh. Now oh, then, young Dick, have you been a merry little boy this year? <clears throat> oh, typical. Fast asleep. Right, is this Dinky's talking full of garlic? I'll go and get your big present. <sighs> Ow! Uh, 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 yes, uh, yes, I ain't that. That way, Ben. Right! That's it. That's as far as I go. Uh, oh, look. There's Prince Dick. Oi! Lazy Bones! Get up! Come on! We've got work to do! Let him Come on. sleep. Oh, doesn't he look sweet? Oh. Yeah, whatever. Now, I'm just going to uh, leave him a little note on it so that when he wakes up, he knows it's for him. To the princess. <laughs> there we go. Ah. Oh, that's... Shallot. Oh. Right, now we sorted out that ogre. Let's go and see about my Betsy. Uh -huh. hey, hi. <laughs> 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 oh, what? Is it raining? In me ear? Oh. Oh, he's been. He's been! Oh, 40 Whiffmas has brought me a stinky stocking! Oh, and it's full of garlic! Oh, I love garlic! Oh, presents. Oh, wow. Oh, oh, this is the biggest Garlic Tuesday present ever! Oh, thank you, 40 Whiffmas! Oh, oh, it's to both of us. Maybe I should wait till Dom gets here to open it. Nah. <laughs> ho, 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 ho. Go, go, go. Oh, Farty Whiffers. Is that really you? Mm. Oh, thank you for the present. Uh. It's enormous. Mm. That, that's not from me. Huh? I'll get you a cow pack in an old boot. Huh? Maybe there is a real Farty Whiffers. What? What? Nothing. No, no, nothing. I, I wouldn't open that far with you. No, no, I wouldn't open that far. <laughs> it's a crazed ogre covered in sweat. Oh, and he's wet himself as well. This is the stinkiest Garlic Tuesday present ever. Thank you, Farty Whiffers. Farty Whiffers? Step away from the box. Oh, come on, look. He's lovely. And ogre's not just for Garlic Tuesday, he's for life. <laughs> Do not touch the ogre! Oh, come on, look. He's so cute, aren't you? You're so cute! So, 
Here's your reward. Mm. A certificate of ownership for my Betsy. Mm. Oh, well, I can safely say, on my reputation as a magnificent wizard, that you will never be hearing from that troublesome ogre ever again. Ogre! Oh. Ogre! Oh, 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 oh. He's really mad! I think he's already eaten, Dom! It's a good job he hasn't eaten Farty Whiffmas, or there'll be no more Garlic Tuesday. Oh, for heaven's sake, Dick! It's me! I am Farty Whiffmas. Dom? You mean, for all these years, yes. you've been travelling round in a magic green trough, handed out all the presents, yet yeah, no! I mean, there is no Farty Whiffmas. I made it all up, you bonehead! What? Guys? The ogre? Not now, Lucian. Shut it! You mean you made it all up? Yes. There is no Garlic Tuesday. Oh, only you could bring more and wouldn't have realised this years ago. <laughs> this has to be the worst day of my life. I just don't see how this day could get any worse. Um, that ogre might be about to rip your head off. Oh, yeah. He's <laughs> 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 backing away. How's he doing that? It must be all the garlic he's been eating. The yoga doesn't like it. You got him cornered. Keep going, Dick. Uh, guys, give me a hand here. Look, I've got more garlic in my sack. Oh. Okay, come on, put it in your mouth. Oh. On the count of three. Ready? One, two, three. I think he's working. Oh. And now for the final move. <laughs> 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 oh well, Johnny. <laughs> Johnny? Oh. Right, should we, uh, should we go? Mm -hmm. Yeah. yeah. <whistles> with the ogre of much silage slain, along with all the villagers, our heroes headed off to add Betsy to the potion. You saw the look on Johnny Greenfinger's face. He believed in Farty Whiffmas. Yes, well, maybe he is real in a way, if someone believes in him. Yeah, and if it hadn't been for Farty Whiffmas and his sack, we never would have got away from that ogre. I cannot wait until next year. Only 364 days to go. <laughs> God, Tuesday, God, Has anyone God, got a peppermint? <laughs> and so the princes and their faithful companions set off to find the next ingredient for the potion and possibly pick up some mouthwash along the way. But wait! What's this, boys and girls? Can you hear the sound of jingle smell? Oh, but Prince Dom said he didn't believe in me. Oh, don't you worry about it. Oh, no. 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 They know their music.